Lectures on Accountancy, Consignment, Dell Credit Commission, Consignment Accounting, Dell Credit Commission. Dear students, today let us learn about Dell Credit Commission that is paid to the consignee by consignor in consignment business and accounting. Dell Credit Commission Definition and Explanation Dell Credit Commission is related to credit sales. It is a type of commission which a consignor offers to the consignee who guarantees the collection of payment from credit customers. It is different from the consignee's ordinary commission and works like a credit insurance to consignor in the event a customer becomes insolvent or fails to make payment due to some other reason. In consignment account, Dell Credit Commission appears on the debit side along with ordinary commission allowed to the consignee. Calculation of Dell Credit Commission Dell Credit Commission is paid to the consignee in addition to his ordinary commission. It is usually computed at a certain pre-agreed percentage of total gross sale proceeds. For example, the cash sale are 5000 and credit sale are 2500. If an ordinary commission of 10% and the Dell Credit Commission of 5% are allowed to the consignee, the two types of commission would be computed separately as follows. Ordinary Commission 5000 plus 2500 into 10% 750. Dell Credit Commission 5000 plus 2500 into 5% 375. The computation of Dell Credit Commission is similar to the computation of ordinary commission. However, the consignor and consignee may sign a separate agreement regarding the calculation and payment of Dell Credit Commission. Points to remember If Dell Credit Commission is not paid to the consignee, the consignor will bear the losses resulting from consignment related to bad debts. If Dell Credit Commission is paid to the consignee, the consignee will bear the losses resulting from consignment related to bad debts. Entries related to credit sales and Dell Credit Commission Entries in the books of consignor 1. When credit sales are made, consignee account debit. Consignment account credit. 2. Entry for bad debts. No entry. When Dell Credit Commission is allowed to the consignee, the consignor has nothing to do with bad debts. 3. For consignee's ordinary Dell Credit Commission, consignment account debtor to consignee account credit. Entries in the books of consignee. 1. When credit sales are made, consignment debtor debit consignment account credit. 2. At the time of collection of debts, cash and bank debit. Consignment debtor's account credit. 3. Entry for bad debts. Bad debts account debtor. Consignment debtor's account credit. Entries in the books of consignee. 4. Continued. Entry for closing bad debts account. Consignee adjusts the amount of bad debts against his commission from consignment. The bad debts are debited to the consignment received account. At the end of the year, the net balance of commission received account is transferred to the profit and loss account. This is done by means of the following journal entries. 1. The following entry closes the bad debts account to consignment received account. Commission received account debit, bad debts account credit. 2. The following entry closes the commission received account to profit and loss account. Profit and loss account debit, consignment received account credit. Example. Consignment accounting with and without Dell Credit Commission. On 1st October 2020, Kim Manchester consigned good costing 50000 to Harry of Bristol. Krim paid 120 as railway freight and 150 as insurance. On 31st December 2020, an account sales was received from Harry showing that all the goods were sold for 75,000. Out of us, 20,000 were sold on credit. Harry paid 115 as carriage and 125 as storage expenses. A credit customer who purchased goods 2,500 did not make payment and the debit debt Proved bad. All other payments were successfully collected by Harry. The Harry was entitled to an ordinary commission of 10% on gross sale proceeds. A cross check was enclosed with the account sales for the balance amount required. 1. Drop necessary ledger accounts in the books of Kim and Harry using above information. 2. Disregard the requirement 1 and refer to the original information. Drop necessary ledger accounts in the books of Kim and Harry. Assuming the Harry is given 5% Dell Credit Commission in addition to his ordinary commission, other things remaining the same. Solution Well, Dell Credit Commission is given to Harry. In the books of Kim, the consignor, consignment to Harry account. On the debit side, goods and on consignment, 
five fifty thousand cash expenses railway freight hundred and twenty incidents hundred and fifty December thirty one Harry carriage hundred and fifteen storage one twenty five ordinary commission seven thousand five hundred Dell credit commission three thousand seven fifty profit and loss account consignment thirteen thousand two forty and the credit side Harry seventy five thousand. In the books of Kim continued Harry account on the debit side consignment to Harry seventy five thousand on the credit side consignment to Harry two forty consignment to Harry ordinary commission seven thousand five hundred consignment to Harry Dell credit commission three thousand seven fifty bank draft sixty thousand sixty three thousand five hundred ten in the books of Harry the consignee Kim account on the credit side bank cash sales fifty five thousand. Consignment debtors twenty thousand total seventy five thousand and the debit side consignment received sorry commission received ordinary commission seven thousand five hundred del credit commission three thousand seven fifty bank two forty bank draft sixty three thousand five ten total seventy five thousand in the books of Harry the consignee continued consignment debtors account on the debit side Kim twenty thousand and the credit side bank collection seventeen thousand five hundred commission received two thousand five hundred twenty thousand twenty thousand. Commission received account on the credit side Kim eleven thousand two fifty on the debit side consignment to debtor two thousand five hundred profit and loss eight thousand seven fifty. Recap. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel Accounts Lobby for various solved problems and lectures on accountancy.